In this graph, I want to show you how to directly label lines in a line graph. You're seeing an example here, so instead of using a legend, I'm using labels that show the audience exactly which line is which part of the graph, which is a better practice than simply using a legend. How do we create this? Well, when we go to Google Sheets to create it, there's a couple of things to notice about the setup here. This is using a feature called annotations, and annotations in a graph allow you to place text beside a particular data point, and then Google Sheets turns that into a label as part of the graph. So what we've done here is we have a <clears throat> blank column beside each of our data series, and in the last data point, because I want the label at the end, the right side, I have placed a formula. So notice I did not type in product A. I placed a formula that references the series name. This means that when the series name changes, the label automatically changes. So you want to do this to reduce the amount of manual work, also reduce the opportunity for making an error when this gets updated. So once we have done set up our data this way, we select all of it, including all of the columns that have the labels, and we say insert a chart. We're going to select the chart type to be a line and you'll notice in the preview on the right hand side you'll see the labels have been automatically added. That's what the annotation feature does for you. So I'm going to insert this graph and then I just need to format it. So I'm going to go to my advanced edit and I'm going to get rid of the chart title going to get rid of the legend because of course now it's a total duplication we don't need it and if I want to on a line graph not make the grid lines so prominent what I can do is on the vertical axis I can go down to the grid lines and I can set the color to be maybe say a lighter gray so they're still there but the lines the actual data is what's emphasized so now I can update this. And now like every other graph, I can copy it and go to my blank slide, paste it in, say yes, link it to the data. And now I have a line graph on my slide where the labels are part of the graph and each line is directly labeled. In PowerPoint, when you use a professional presentation program, this labeling is far easier because you don't have to add extra data series. You can select a data point on a particular, a, a label for a specific data point. Uh, you don't have to, again, put it in on a particular cell. It's a lot easier to do it when you use a professional presentation program.